هذا هو اليوم الذي صنعه الرب فلنفرح ولنتهلل به المسيح قام من بين الأموات ووطئ الموت بالموت ووهب الحياة للذين في القبور المسيح قام من بين الأموات ووطئ الموت بالموت ووهب الحياة للذين في القبور Christos on esti epne kron thanaton, thanaton batisas, keti sentith ni masi zoif karisa menos. Well, we're definitely getting a uh, late start to the day today. Actually, I'm late to getting to X Plus because uh, there is so much stuff to do to get the day started that I just now have been able to sort of sit down and. Uh, and uh, start talking to you guys. Uh, so basically, I got up around noon and started building around, getting things organized, and um, the new project that's on the list now that has to be done is that the summer's coming. I've got to redesign and re retool the uh, cooling system here. Uh, I said now in my in, in the summer phase now it's around 80 degrees. I got to make sure I got to stay that the place stays at 80 degrees, and then the equipment that's in here can run at the 80 degree mark in terms in terms of the environment. So that's uh, one of the things I was doing today before I got started. Then I had a um, I didn't do the editing last night. I did the editing today. This uh, so I did that. Did the editing now it's uploading uh, the. the uh, 23rd and 24th, uh, which is one day. That vlog is now being uploaded. That show is uploaded. Uh, I have to finish working on the opening, the opening theme for uh, for Monday for the the, the new opening theme. Uh, I'm also considering adding a closing theme. Then uh, work has to be done on the library server and then I have to take a walk around all the different institutes that I have uh, doing, that I'm doing research in uh, making sure that I've got uh, uh, the next sort of step in place so uh, you know it takes a while to get everything done so bit by bit you go through things so and said, today's gonna be pretty, uh, you know a pretty full day even though it's Friday and uh, I was going to take things a little slower today. Uh, that doesn't sort of seem to be the case. And think uh, moving right along, uh, sort of, sort of quickly fill the day up. Anyways, um, I think that's good enough for the opening now. You know, this is a sort of our, 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 our first segment of the day, and I will be coming back to you periodically as uh, more and more. As I get a chance to. Alrighty, so see you in a bit. Alrighty, <laughs> it's around 11:30, and been in the next part of my day started. The goal here now is to uh, finish up the week, uh, clean up uh, the leftover projects that, that that sort of need to be cleaned up a little bit. But that again, that, that doesn't nearly end the week. It, what it does does it just cleans up from what I've, everything I've done, and starts getting me ready for Monday. Uh, not that I'm be taking the weekend off. It's just that it d does take a couple of days to really reorient from finishing certain projects. Up. I, I, it, I, it, you schedule out uh, how long a project's going to take, approximately. But a project doesn't always take that long. Like I had planned the entire weekend, uh, you know, not over the weekend to do the cooling system, and installing a new cooling system in here. The new cooling system is already operating, and I got it operational within a matter of two hours. There's the uh, compressor kicking in that does dehumidifying and then the cooling. There's another larger fan in front of it that pushes and circulates the air forward 
And basically, I'm using the principle. The, cool, the, the principle I'm using to cool the place here is basically the concept of wind chill effect. That if you can get enough air moving at an appropriate rate, then you can actually cool the place just using the wind chill effect. And uh, so far, it's actually worked. It, it, the humidity in here is significantly less, and uh, the temperature is starting to drop. So. Within two hours, <laughs> project complete, so that leaves a, a fair bit of time for that. Um, the new projects that are coming in are new video tests that will help me, uh, give me uh, more options in terms of how I film. Uh, as I said, I've got the Linux music system on two systems. Because I plan to start doing the, the, the first the music tracks th this weekend. I'm also planning um, to work on uh, uh, to work on uh, spreading out the video editing process. I had done that before, but now I'm going to sort of revamp it, uh, sort of improve upon it, so that. Uh, Filming is done in different rooms, along with processing, editing, uh, and uh, the, push, the pushing out. So uh, that's, those video tests are going to go on uh, this weekend. And hopefully, if I can get everything in working order by the end of the weekend, Monday, is we'll be getting back to documentary production, uh, 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 adventures in the library, uh, the mass tutorials. Uh, all the news, the economic reports, all will start coming back out again uh, as the new system comes into play and really be starts starts working. I got a good schedule in terms of how we're going to how, how I'm going to uh, uh, actually uh, schedule out the work. That's the whole issue: is scheduling out the work uh, so that you don't uh, clog up the system and that everything works at a proper flow. Uh, I still have to do cleaning up on um, on the main s library server, but I also, also I also have to do some more work, get further into uh, understanding networking within Linux uh, to improve the network around the network over here. Uh, so I, there's a number of things to do, number of things to clean up. I'm still <laughs> finishing cleaning up my place. Uh, the goal now is uh, this weekend, as I continue cleaning, to, to finish up the kitchen, get the kitchen in film working order so that I can start filming uh, some test shots for a new documentary uh, uh, based, around, based on cooking. Uh, and then it says we we'll slowly move our way out from there. Anyway, uh, back to uh, my work schedule here. And they'll probably talk to you a little bit after midnight. Alright. <laughs> As I said before, yeah, well, it's not really said before, but uh, it's right around 1.30 in the morning right now. This is kind of the problem that I have is uh, Cassandra at Nerdzarell. She always does the awesome thing of the day or uh, thinks of ways to say goodnight. The problem that I have is that. Uh, uh, there is no real good night. There's no end of the day. So you just sort of keep <laughs> moving forward. And in between uh, the uh, in between these things, uh, uh, different events and the work, uh, I find I take some time off and end up going to sleep. But uh, when that actually occurs, uh, it really depends. I just finished. I'm, I'm doing a tour around YouTube. Seeing what I can find, some information I can find. It's like uh, strolling around the library stack. That's what I'm doing now. Uh, seeing if if there's anything I can add to my library. Then I got to figure out where I'm going to put it in the library. Uh, at the same time, I'm watching uh, uh, a cooking show. Uh, so I, I do a variety of things at the same time. Uh, I'm going to go on and watch something else now. Uh, I found something of interest. I've taken, I've taken my notes, 
And now I'm um, moving on further into it. You can find things that are on YouTube. Uh, one of the one of the give me example. One of the things I was able to find on YouTube uh, is uh, my background is Greek Syrian, and there's an enormous amount of culture there. But uh, the way my life has gone, I've never been able to travel there. But on YouTube, uh, with all the different uh, people posting to YouTube, uh, I can now uh, do a tour on YouTube of uh, various different Greek, Greek music according to region. So I can go on into region to region to region to region and hear the differences in the music. And then they also have, if you dig deep enough into YouTube, uh, they'll have uh, older... Uh, much older from the 1920s, 1930s, they'll have what I guess what you call the equivalent of the Greek blues, uh, where you can hear some of these old mountain uh, singers, the crooners, uh, actually singing their tunes, and they've got them on all on YouTube. So you can actually do a good uh, music study. Uh, particularly going into the, 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 this different type of what we call village music, uh, right on YouTube. So uh, YouTube and much of the Internet, if it's done right, uh, and that, but it does take time. It's, it, it's hours at a time. You can use YouTube to really, um, uh, how should I say, uh, be like an academic library. So that's what I'm doing now is I'm adding to my library. I'm fixing things up and I'm looking at adding new sections to things. So, day's not ending, it's 1.30 in the morning, and uh, as I go through this, uh, maybe around 3, 4 o'clock, I'll, uh, uh, I'll add another comment. <laughs> uh, it's just about, about uh, 3 o'clock in the morning now. Uh, just got through watching some videos on YouTube. We got some new uh, documentary ideas, so I'm actually laying out in my notes now uh, some of the ideas I want to follow in the documentary. Uh, aiming here, this is the schedule now for the weekend, I'm aiming to get back into documentary production. Uh, still going to be doing a lot of the testing to try to push the equipment, equip, the equipment further, but get more into documentary produ mm -hmm. production but get more into the documentary production, get back on schedule again uh, as of Monday. That's the goal now. So the weekend is now, the schedule for the week is more or less set. I've got some ideas what I want to do. Uh, I'm still going to do some cleaning up here, uh, rearranging some of the office, and that's really going to push things uh, push things through. So uh, we'll see how things go and work from there. Uh, anyways, uh, you're kind of seeing uh, a lot of a lot of my library work. As I said, it's 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 uh, three o'clock in the morning, and the day hasn't ended. Uh, it probably won't end for another hour or so. Uh, we'll see if I say good night or not. It depends on how tired I am. Uh, but uh, is it you know bit by bit? There's re repairs, maintenance. Uh, in addition to uh, moving things forward, and so that's one of the things I'm doing now. I've got a couple more uh, videos to watch, and then uh, from here it's uh, off to uh, it's off to uh, other parts unknown. <laughs> Anyways, uh, this is about 4:15 in the morning. Uh, just finished the, some adjustments to the cooling system. Now I'm going through the last tweets, and it looks like I've got a pretty full weekend ahead. Uh, a lot of projects to work on. This is sort of like. Uh, See, so projects uh, come online, come offline. Some projects uh, aren't, haven't been developed enough, so they don't have their own space. Uh, others 
and have got to a point where not much more can be done on them, and so they're either halted or stalled for just a little bit until uh, we can uh, that, uh, that that more work can be done on them. And that's sort of what I got to figure out now. Is I got to figure out uh, what uh, what uh, projects need to be uh, fixed up again, or what projects have, have been stalled for too long, and to see if if there's anything that can be done to sort of to really get them to be started again. Um, And then there's other projects that are just, you know, that are in development that are sort of coming up. And that's one of the things I'm working on now is, is that uh, one of the, uh, I'm working on a new uh, section of uh, engineering videos. And uh, I have to go through the project notes to see if there's a sufficient enough, uh, sufficient enough a, a, a sort of a sufficient amount of uh, notes to m to move the project from one stage to the next stage, uh, but I'm not really too sure yet how, how it's actually going to work out. Uh, so we'll see what happens there. Uh, Too well. We're now just sort of checking uh, something out on, on on Twitter, and then on to tum then from Twitter to Tumblr. Oh, uh, anyways, uh, this is not going to be going to the editing bay until uh, probably around noon, and then we'll proceed from uh, there to get it uh, edited, rendered, and then up onto the internet, onto YouTube, so that you can see it. Anyways, or anyway, uh, time to continue on. We'll see when this day ends. Free speech rules here at Democratic Earth.